Hi guys, it's Bryn. I thought I would do a haul video for you guys since I got a lot of stuff today. Um, let's start with this. I got this in the mail today. This is the Spellbinders. Um, Sprightly Sprockets is what it's called. And I can't wait to use that. That's going to be lots of fun. Okay, so I've got a lot of stuff to show, so I'm going to kind of dig in the bags. They're over on the side. <laughs> okay, so um, I went to Bed Bath & Beyond, and I got one of these um, oven liner doohickeys, and let's see if I can pop it open here. Maybe not. Okay, well, anyway, it's brown. It's like the craft mat. Um, I, I kept this, these little plastic rivets are being a problem. I'll have to figure out how to get into that. Anyway, um, it was $9.99, but I had a 20% off coupon, so I got it for $8. But that was good, because I need one another one of those. I've got to figure out a place to put this stuff. Ah, basket. <laughs> All right, empty basket. And I got a couple of water bottles as well. Okay. I have to stop using plastic, you know. Okay, so here. Um, I got a lot of stuff on the clearance rack. They must have just redid their clearance rack at Hobby Lobby. So now we're talking about Hobby Lobby. Um, these are iron-ons. Um, and this is, let me see if I can put it up here so you can see what it looks like. This right here is what it looks like in the little square. Okay, that's one of them. And I got it for 77 cents. And these are meant to go on t-shirts, so they're rather large. And uh, here's another one. There we go. That. Got three of them. 77 cents. Now, oh, I love this one. This is gorgeous. Let's see how can I can turn it. How about like that. There we go. And these are iron-ons meant for t-shirts, so I don't know exactly what I'm going to do with these, but it looks like fun. Okay, I got a package of brushes. These were on sale. Let's take everything out of this bag. Get rid of it. <laughs> Noisy. Okay, so uh, Lang Nickel brushes or art journaling. That looks good. I got a spare X-Acto knife to put in my travel bag. Um, there's a little 96 cent calendar. I got this for the pictures. It has some kind of nice pictures on the back there. You can see what they look like. Traveling. And I got... Okay, these were in the, where the clay is. They're like texture plates, but they're like unmounted rubber. So this one is like a cheesecloth. Oh dear. Uh, let me see. How can we get... There we go. That's a little bit better, but that's like a cheesecloth texture, and this one is like a crackle, which is kind of cool. I have a small crackle. I did not have a big one, and I, w I wish for one, so that was a, a good deal. Okay, let me move that. Then I got some stencils. Oh, that's a cute one there. And this one... Uh, it was 38 cents, and what it is is a cell phone and an uh, iPod. Um, they're in there together. Yeah, that was on the clearance rack, so that was pretty cool. Um, oh, I got some, <laughs> this is fun, Celtic tattoos for the designs. Aren't they pretty? Very nice. And um, oh, one more little stencil. Little, this is sort of Celtic um, in nature. It's kind of cool. Okay, next bag. Let's see. There's lots of stuff in here, so let me go ahead and pull it all out. Oh, goodness. Tons and tons of stuff in here. Okay, that's part of it. <laughs> Alright, this was on the clearance. This is a Spellbinders. It has, um, uh, like, garden critters. Um, there's a dragonfly, a ladybug type beetle thing. I don't know what that is. I can't really see it. Um, this is like a butterfly or moth. A little leaf and a branch. So that's, that's kind of cool, and doesn't show it on the back, but that's okay. Um, so I got that on the clearance rack. And then I got a set of these for the kids. Um, Blast Effects Dual Action Spray Riders. Now, I don't know exactly what they do, but they're like markers, I suppose, and you, you spritz the, um, there you go, you spritz the top of it, 
It's like a, a bulb, like a turkey baster. <laughs> but this is this is the three colors, and then I got those three, so they have a variety to play with. <laughs> okay, let's see what else is in here. Oh, I have always wanted to try this stuff. Easy form plaster cloth wrap. You wet it and you can cover things with it or mold with it, like over wire, a wire um, um, mold. But you make your own sculpture thing. Anyway, so I've, I've always wanted to play with that. That's cool. And I got some extra rulers for my travel bag. Always need extra rulers. There's um, two clear ones and one of the um, ones you can cut against the um, aluminum metal rulers. Those are always nice to have. Oh, got some packing tape on, on the clearance row. I don't know why that was on clearance, but anyway. Uh, 89 cents for uh, a half dozen already decorated binder clips. That would be nice in the journaling. Oh, this is a Christmas present. All right, we can't show that. <laughs> okay. Um, these are cupcake wrappers. Now, I thought this was kind of cool. Uh, they've got a birthday theme. It says happy birthday. I don't know if you can... Let me see if I can get the camera to focus. There we go. Cupcake wrappers. They're really cute. Um, you can, here you can kind of see what that looks like. It says happy birthday. There you go. You can see it good. Okay. Like that. Um... The red policy envelopes. Um, this was the only. See, the policy has the flap at the top. Let's see if we can get that in there. There we go. Um, the red ones, bright red, were on the clearance rack for dollar forty-three for twenty-five envelopes. So hey, you can't go wrong with that. I'm thinking, uh, thinking ahead to Christmas here. All right, and I got a couple of these. I don't know where the other one is. It's in the bag someplace. Um, they were on the clearance. This is the Zutter. Um, book closures. Um, I've never used these and they have rivets that come with them, uh, but I love the look. So I got a couple of those, but that was cool. I'm going to get rid of this plastic bag. It's noisy. All right, and I got two of the uh, Tim Holtz smaller uh, collection stamps. Um, these are smaller than the ones that I already have, so I thought that would be good for ATCs especially. So that, that's good there. Um, that was cool. It was not on sale, but hey, I got them anyway. Um, and this is a Bow Bunny... Let's see. <laughs> Upside down. This is a Bow Bunny Believe um, book where each page is a letter. Let's see. Here you can see on the label what it might look like. And I got that on the clearance rack as well. I love Hobby Lobby when they just do their, their clearances. Oh, and uh, this is a Bow Bunny stickerage that um, I'm going to hang on the wall because I'm supposedly supposed to be still working on my uh, December daily Christmas albums. I've got two going and um, of course you know they get stalled out halfway through the month because things get too busy. So anyway that's where that's going to go for 71 cents. That, that'll go with what I already have um, for Bow Bunny. Oh, let's see. And oh, also on clearance, I got some rub-on alphabets in white, which I had not had, so that is a cool thing. And I also got, this is a metal tool, a metalwork tool. I have a whole bunch of them, and this was 30% or 40% off. I can't remember. Anyway, it was on sale, and I didn't know that till I got to the register, so that was cool. But it makes uh, textures. You can change, here's the, the tool, and you can add... Uh, a tool, screwing them into both ends, so you can have two on there at once. But it's a wide little roller, and you roll it on the metal, and it makes textures. It's really cool. This one is really cool. It looks like a little tiny. Let's see if I can get that to focus. There we go. A little tiny pie flute. Um, the way that that makes a little wavy line. That, that's going to be really cool. I can't wait to use that. Okay, next bag. And I've got three more. <laughs> Oh, goodness. Okay. So, I, I do quilting and cut fabric and, and cut large pieces of paper, so I thought this um, this thick ruler uh, would do well. It's long. I think it's 18 inches. Uh, yes, 18 inches long. And it has a little knob, a little handle. So that's, that's a cool tool. That'll come in very handy. I keep wishing for a longer ruler and never have one. 
Um, oh, here's some more stamps. All right, this one, let me see, it's called uh, from Glitz Design. Um, distress something or other. I can't read under the label. Uh, it doesn't say it any place else. Oh, here we go. There it is, right there. It says distressing and then has a number. Um, but it's from Glitz Designs. And um, there's tiny text, which I don't have. There's uh, dots. There's um, a rough texture um, as if it was oh, plaster on the wall or something, but it's really fine. Um, there's some squares, like a mesh. That's really cool. And then some numbers. I love this. That is so cool. Love it, love it. Okay, oh, and this is a new Seven Gypsies Av Avignon Clear Stamps. Uh, there's 22 stamps in here, and they're tiny. They're perfect for ATCs and also for um, labels on the little tiny glass bottles, which I have a jar of little glass bottles that that's going to go great on. Okay, but you can see how neat they are. I love this. They're so delicate. Just love that designs. Okay, and I got... Let's see. Oh, I got this stencil. It's a leaf. It's a little bit messed up right there, but I think I can fix that. I didn't mind. It was the only one they had, and I wanted it. <laughs> and then I got dots, which I cannot cut myself because of the size, but this will do a page in the art journal, so that's a good thing. Um, more stamps. Um, let me see. Girlfriend stamps. And there's... Oh, there's... Oh, I love this. It's like lace doilies. That is so pretty. Didn't have anything like this. You can see the rest of them there. Really, really cool. And it says, Girlfriends are forever friends. And super cute. Uh, hello, gorgeous, smile. XX, oh, XOXO. And girls night out. And then a really delicate paisley thing. Paisley stamp. Really pretty. Love that. Um, these were on the clearance. Let's see. These are borders. So those will look really nice on top of tape, I think. Without using masking tape, put those on top. Okay, and then I did a splurge here. Uh, it was uh, it was over $30 off, so uh, this is the Copic marker um, airbrush system. So I, I went ahead and, and got that. It's the only one they had, and they probably won't carry them anymore. So no opportunities for coupons there, and an extra can of the air that goes with that. And for some reason, they had post-it notes on clearance, so I got a couple of those, and I'm always using post-it notes for everything. Post-it note queen. Okay, let's see. Let me move this now. Still have more. <laughs> and now he knows where I'm going to put this stuff. Oh. Okay, um, on top of a lot of things being on sale at Hobby Lobby, I got to use my 40% coupon on watercolor paper. 